Hurricane Harvey left thousands of Texans homeless without cars and jobs, but a job fair in Dallas today is helping evacuees get their lives back in order. Our Jack Fink downtown Dallas, where organizers say they are encouraged. I'm not picking. I'm looking for construction. Derek and Sarah Killian of Port Arthur never thought they'd be starting over after beginning their new life together just one month ago. But here they were at a job fair for Harvey evacuees in Dallas, featuring 120 employers. I'm going to go to all of them, and hopefully one of them will hire me today. I would prefer one today because of the no-income situation, but yeah, I know we will get a job. Every time the bell rang meant another evacuee was hired. Some companies had 10 jobs to offer. Others, like FedEx Ground, had more. Altogether, I can definitely say over 1,000 positions for sure. Yes. And DFW. And DFW, yes. This job fair is giving the Killians hope, something they haven't had in the week Harvey forced them to evacuate. We're looking to try and stay. Uh, we get Port Arthur is devastated. The Killians say what makes matters worse, they can't receive FEMA disaster assistance money because Harvey's damage is keeping the agency from accessing their rental home and verifying their claim. And we're broke. It's frustrating. It's aggravating. He says it is overwhelming. I could provide for myself before this stuff happened. It's, it's, it's embarrassing. I don't, I don't like it. I don't like it. So we really need these jobs. We wish them all the best. And Workforce Solutions of Greater Dallas tells me nearly 470 evacuees received job interviews today. 124 had job offers and 57 were hired on the spot. Live in Dallas, Jack Fink, CBS 11 News. Great stuff. Jack, thank you for the info. We appreciate it.